today's pollinator habitat tip, we're going to talk about how mowing can be a great management tool that we use early on in a planting's establishment. This is late May, and this is actually a project that we did a dormant seeding on last fall. And if we didn't know any better, I think it would be really easy to look at this and say, did I get bad seed? Did I plant it wrong? What is going on here? This can be a pretty normal first year look for a planting. Today we're gonna to talk about how mowing, when used at the right height and the right time, can be your go-to management tool. So we actually have two years worth of site preparation activities that occurred on this location prior to planting. And here we are. We have a bunch of penny crests, lamb's quarter, giant ragweed coming in, none of which was intended, none of which we want here. So now we're going to use mowing as our early management technique. If we're going to use mowing as the management technique on our new plantings, there's two critical components that have to be applied for it to be successful. The first is the mowing height. We want to mow these projects at a height of 9 to 12 inches tall. So if you think that you're going to accomplish this using a lawn mower or a finishing mower, probably not going to work because it's going to mow that new planting too short. We want to be using something like a bush hog or a shredder, something like this mower that is hooked up to a tractor three point so that we can raise the height of that mower to our desired height of nine to 12 inches. Our second consideration is about the timing of when we start our mowing activities. We want to start mowing before the vegetation has gotten so tall that when we mow it, there's actually enough vegetation that it creates a mulch that could smother our young, fragile seedlings. So I tell people as a rule of thumb that when the vegetation gets to be thigh high, mow it to just below knee high. Based on those two criteria, it's possible that in the first year of your planting, you might actually have to mow it two, three, four times. And in the second year, maybe not at all, maybe once or twice. Based on the criteria of not letting things get too tall and mowing it to a height of nine to 12 inches. The frequency of your mowing is probably gonna be most influenced by the site preparation that you put in on the front end, and then how much rainfall happens on the project in your area. Using mowing as a management technique for your new or really young habitat projects, and then making sure to think about the two important considerations of the timing and the frequency of your mowing and your mowing height now that's a recipe for success that's going to make for great habitat. <laughs>